Hey guys, okay, so the first thing I'm going to start with is moisturizer. You should always moisturize your face before you do anything to it. And that will just make sure that everything goes on smoothly. And then I'm going to use my Age Rewind Instant Maybelline Concealer. I love this. It really, really applies really evenly and smoothly. So I'm just applying that to any bumps that I have. And then I'm going to take Elf's Powder Brush and then just blot that and make sure that I can just smooth out everything evenly. Then I'm going to take my BB cream. This is Maybelline's Dream Fresh BB cream. This is the first BB cream I've ever used and actually I'm in love with it. It's super, super light, which is awesome for the summertime and it's not heavy um, enough for school. So it's really great. Um, it's a light coverage, but it's just enough for me because I don't break out as much as I used to because I got help for that. But yeah, this is a really, really light coverage. So this is perfect for school so you don't sweat it off during the day. And then I'm using e.l.f.'s Contouring Blush and Bronzing Palette and I'm just going to pick up a contouring brush. Um, and I'm going to use my, my bronzer and then I'm just going to apply that on my cheekbones and just kind of contour my face a little bit. Then I'm going to be taking Maybelline's Dream Bouncy Blush. After that, I'm going to take my Naked Palette and I'm going to be using a light sheer color. And that's just going to use that as my highlighter and that will just really make my face have a nice glow to it. Then I'm going to pick up the same color and I'm going to use that on the highlights of my eyes, of course, and put that on the inner corners and then on the top of my brow bone. And then I'm going to use that as an all-over color too. Then I'm going to pick up a flat brush and I'm going to use a color called Sidecar on the Naked palette. And I'm just going to apply that all over my lid as well. This is a really, really pretty, um, like a shimmery brown color and it's really, really gorgeous. It's not too much, but just enough to give your eyes some color. Then I'm going to pick up a blending brush and this is going to go into my crease and I'm going to pick up Buck. It's more of a matte um, dark brown and I'm going to work that into my crease and then bring that up a little bit and then put it into my V-line and then I'm going to grab a fluffier brush and pick up some shimmery color, any light color that you have and then just kind of blend those two colors together and that will give you a nice smoky eye. And to finish it off, instead of a harsh black eyeliner, I'm just going to use a black um, eyeshadow in your place. It's not as harsh and it'll stay on better than you know regular eyeliner which usually fades by during the day. And then I'm going to be taking a, a extra lash thickening mascara. After I finish my mascara I'm going to pick up a um, tinted moisture. This is Baby Lips from Maybelline which I absolutely love. And then I'm going to be taking a bright red lipstick that I wear every single day. And then just to finish that off, if you put a lighter color in the middle of your lips, it'll kind of highlight your lips and make them look a little bit more fuller. And yeah, that'll complete my makeup look. It's just a really simple, snooky eye, nothing dramatic, super light and simple and sweet. After that, I'm going to go into my hair and I'm just going to straighten it because first days of school, I never really straighten my hair throughout the year. So I usually go out with a bang and <laughs> just straighten my hair a little bit. So I'm just going to straighten my baby pieces and just make sure that's even. And then I'm going to pull up my bangs to get that some volume. And then what I'm going to do is start with the top of my bangs and then just start by twisting that back. And as you twist, you're going to grab more and more hair as you can see. And then as you twist that back, then you're going to push it up a little bit. And then you're going to secure that with a bobby pin. And this will give you a really, really sweet, cute look. Just something to change up your everyday down straight hair. And it's really, really sweet and sophisticated. And I absolutely love this look. Then it's time for my outfit. This is a maxi dress that I got at Route 21. I don't know if y'all have that, but it's close to where I live, and it's really, really cute. It's fitted, and it's a razor back in the back, and it's just a black and white stripes. Um, the, the straps are thick enough for me to wear to school, and it's long enough, so you don't have to worry about any dress codes. And I'm pairing that with my colorful bracelets and necklace and a bright pink purse since my outfit is so simple. So yeah, I really hope that you guys enjoy this tutorial. I hope you guys have a great first day, first day back to school. I love you guys so much, and don't forget to subscribe.